The guy you know very well, Steve Cunningham, who's training in Schuller's gym, will fight Tomasz Adamek on December 22nd. Uh, it will be a rematch. Uh, what's your prediction on this fight? You know, I, I wrote an a article on Facebook, and if I were the brain trust of Steve, I would not act on emotion, I would act on knowledge. And Steve has one fight as a heavyweight. I wouldn't take the fight with Adamac just yet because I, I feel that Thomas is better better suited. I could be wrong. Steve is a very competent fighter. And, and he has a lot of heart, a lot of courage. But I just feel that, that this fight is a little too soon off of one fight at heavyweight. I would have rather foreseen him have two or three more fights before going on to fight Thomas. But I, I think that Thomas is stronger and more adept uh, at heavyweight and I, I suspect that he might win a decision over Steve because Steve may have to try to make adjustments in that fight that he won't, may not be able to make at heavyweight simply because he's not used to fighting that he's going to be 10 15 pounds heavier and like I said uh, Thomas has had time to adjust to the weight that's the only reason but skillfully uh, Steve has the ability but uh, I'd have to go with Adamac. If I had to go with a decision choice, I'd have to, you know, go with Adamac. And I'm looking at not as a just a fan, but I'm looking at as a as a critic. You know, that I think that it's just too soon for Steve to be in the fight. You know, but I think that um, Steve will show up. And I think that he'll put up a great fight. I just don't as a as a if I was his handler, I wouldn't have took taken the fight. No, I wouldn't have done. It, you know. I'd have given him more time to make the adjustments at heavyweight, but this seems too soon. One fight with Gavin and then Adamek. No, I don't. I don't like it. But like I said, anything can happen. On paper, on paper, I I see Adamek winning the fight. How I don't know. You know, Stevie does does not get knocked out by anybody. He gets knocked down, but he always gets back up. But on paper, I think that Adamek wins the fight.